good morning or whatever it is to you guys, but it's I play video games playing a restart. It is I play video games playing Halo 4 for another episode. Let's go. See, that's a better introduction, you know, because I don't stutter as much. And no, I do not have a serious condition of stuttering. It's just when I try to get things, when I try to say things fast, it happens, and I constantly do that. And no, I do not have a condition. Don't throw your fiery skull face into my face. Not nice. Alright, and we are running low on ammo and we're gonna die in a second. Um, how are we gonna do this? For the carbine. Um, look at these things on the freaking wall. Um, how many knights are there? Oh, that's where. I thought the grenade was on my bum. Then I'm out of ammo for this. You gotta be kidding me. Beam rifle, really? I don't know if I like these. Oh, I hate them. They're so annoying. Alright, got that guy. Um, this is what they give me right here? Oh. Things dead. Let's move on. Uh, I have to go over there. Wait, never mind. Let's not go that way. Oh, I don't even see the damn thing open. Hey! Alright. Cortana Bing. to infinity. We're entering the Forerunner structure. Breaking up, but coordinates received, Infinity. Yes, we have these things. I'm just going to follow him. Come on, buddy. I'm over here. Hey, hey. Fine, don't come with me. I'll just take the elevator by myself because I'm a loner. This elevator should take us directly to the coordinates Infinity provided. Almost like the Sentinels wanted us to get the particle cannons offline. This could be a trap. You say that like there's a second possibility? <laughs> Sorry, I'm not talking. I just have no idea what's going on. And he's like trying to fly into the wall. Come on, buddy, I'm following you. Where do I go? Disable particle cannon network. Uh, where do I go? Oh, okay, over here. Who's it? Ah, it's so bright. I don't like the brightness. It messes up We've the camera. The coordinates. This looks like the place. Alright. Let's go do this and there are sentinels everywhere. I feel like they're gonna turn on us like for the fifth millionth time. The particle cannon network can use these arrays for targeting and guidance. 
It's an automated system, so it won't technically allow me to redirect the cannons to fire on one another. Technically. Cortana to Infinity. The guns should be offline. How's it look from up there? Infinity. Cortana. Cortana. Um. Cortana. What happened to Cortana? Cortana. What do I do? They just stole Cortana. Who is that? They're talking with blinking lights. Alright. Um, I don't want to leave her there, but you know. I guess we can't do anything. What's going on? Alright, I guess we're going this way. You guys better be helping me. I don't want to get like hate you guys when I'm trying to fight you. Take forever to die. Um does that go on this way? Dude, what is this? This is so suspicious. They're just like all up in formation. Oh god, bright light that's gonna mess up my camera. Alright, don't let me walk the other way. I don't wanna go in that way. <sighs> Who are you? I am what remains of the Forge, once known as the Librarian. Oh! <gasps> no. My memories were retained to assist humanity on their path to the map. Hold on, this brightness is really killing everything, and you can't see anything. Ah, oh, it's still not working. Exactly. All right, sorry. That plan is now at risk. The didact is leaving Requiem. Soon. You must not allow it. Leaving. He seeks this. The composer. A device which will allow him to finally contain the greatest enemy ever faced by the forerunners. You. What? Are we that cool? No. -uh. What's going on? Mankind spread into the stars with an unexpected desperate violence. Entire systems fell before the Didax warrior servants rose to halt the aggression. Didact finally exhausted the humans after a millennia. His sentence was severe. We had no way of knowing that the forerunners were not your only enemy. Humanity hadn't been expanding. They were running. Weakened from our conflict, we were no match for the parasite which pursued you. The Forerunners made plans for a final great journey, but the Didact refused to yield our mantle of responsibility. He would save all life in the galaxy, at a cost. In the Forerunners' quest for transcendence, the Composer had been intended to bridge the organic and digital realms. It would have made us immortal. But its results soured. The stored personalities fragmented, and our attempts to return them to biological states created only abominations. Such moral concerns faded from the Didact's attention. The flood only assimilated living tissue. The composer would provide the Didact his solution and his revenge. The Prometheans. They're human. They were only the beginning. You would have encrypted your entire race 
if we had not removed the composer from his care and imprisoned him here. I knew he was in prison. When I indexed mankind for repopulation, I hid seeds from the didact. Seeds which would lead to an eventuality. Your physical evolution. Your combat skin. Even your ancilla cordana. You are the culmination of a thousand lifetimes of planning. Planning for what? He has found us. Even in death, her meddling continues. Reclaim her. The gene song I placed within you contains many gifts, including an immunity to the composer. But it must be unlocked. How? Relinquish your contact essence. Your evolutionary journey must be accelerated. Can I defeat the didact without it? No. Then do it. Prepare. Wow. That was an interesting cutscene. Oh, jeez. It's not over and I have to end the video. What's going on? That was boss. Alright guys, in the next episode we're going to use our new power.